Oh, good, good. It was a good opponent uh, <coughs> because it's important that we have our rhythm and it's good to score some goals also. It's always good for the mood because the last game against Borneo we had some, uh, some big individual mistakes also and it's good when the guys, you know, they can play 45 minutes also and sometimes better than training. Uh, kita juga membangun mood lagi untuk menjadi mood yang bagus 
karena kan memang kita lawan Borneo kita banyak, banyak melakukan kesalahan individual jadi makanya dengan uji coba ini maksudnya untuk memakitkan hal-hal itu lagi yang yang udah hilang uh, apa uh, dari pertandingan tadi sepertiga lapangan finishingnya masih kelihatannya masih kurang ya apakah itu jadi bahan evaluasi kembali jelang tiga partai nanti Well, I mean, the whole season is not. It's, we had some some small problems, but this was not the biggest problem the last time. I mean, um, we create again also some situations in Borneo, two penalties they didn't give also, and but we had, you know, when you start a game and it's a 50-50 situation because also Borneo they didn't create so much chances and then. With big mistake, individual mistake, you open the game for the opponent. It's not so easy always also to find your rhythm. And so we have to do this better. We have 10 games in front of us. I spoke also with the team. I mean, you destroyed yourself when you. Everybody can make mistakes. And football is like this when not nobody scored, but not this kind of mistakes. No? Like the first goal, what they scored. and. So it's good to see today also good movements. Of course, in finishing we can do this always better. But for me, it was important how we work today and not that we win 8-0. It's not important. Okay, uh, memang selama sepanjang musim ini memang selalu seperti ini ya, masalah finishingnya. Tapi sebenarnya itu bukan jadi masalah utamanya. Uh, karena kalau misalnya melihat balik waktu lawan kita lawan Borneo, kita seharusnya uh, pertama mikir kita harus dapat dua penalti, tapi nggak dapat. Dan kalau dilihat juga sebenarnya Borneo juga nggak membuat banyak uh, kesempatan dalam pertandingan itu. Dan tapi kita kita sendiri yang membuat membiarkan mereka membuat kesempatan dari kesalahan-kesalahan yang kita buat. Jadi uh, di sisa 10 laga ini, Kosomas berharap kita harus lebih baik lagi. Dan kalau dilihat dari sini dari uji coba hari ini uh, pergerakan pergerakan pemain juga sudah cukup bagus. Tapi memang finishingnya memang uh, harus ditingkatkan lagi. Oops. Oops.